Sansa Stark riding in with the Knights of the Vale, Rowan answering Gonda's call for aid, the clone armies arriving on Geonosis. Everybody loves a great call in the cavalry moment, and this time it happened for real to help protect a little Canadian girl from being bullied for her love of insects. And who were the riders who came to her rescue none other than the scientists in the entomological community that she one day hopes to join. The saviors came not on horses or gunships, but on the backs of beautiful insects not literally, of course, as that would kill them. I'm really proud of this piece, and am thrilled to share the publishing experience with Sophia, who I met collected bugs with this summer pic. Twitter.com 7 sit 7 Giel, Morgan Jackson at BioInfocus September 6, 2017 The story of eight-year-old Sophia Spencer and the entomologist army, which comes via NPR, began when Sophia's mother, Nicole Spencer, emailed the Entomological Society of Canada to ask for help. She explained in the email that her daughter loves to explore the world of bugs and insects but that SHES often teased at school by her peers. In response, there was a massive outpouring of support from the bug studying community, as well as the birth of a new popular hashtag, BugSR for girls. Not only were there hundreds of responses on social media from people championing Sophia and praising her passion, one entomology PhD candidate, Morgan Jackson, even stepped up and decided to put together a whole scientific paper on Sophia's experience, which gave her her first byline. Which means Sophia's now a published scientist at age 8. Bullies got nothing on that, do they? A young girl who loves insects is being bullied needs our support. DM your email well connect you bug sr 4 girls pick twitter.com clear and sock of Canada at can entomologist August 25th 2016 the paper which was published in the annals of the entomological society of America is titled engaging for a good cause Sophia's story and why bug sr 4 girls and focuses on according to the abstract promoting women in science the impact the larger scientific community can have on individuals and the use of social media by scientific societies the paper tackles all three topics mainly by analyzing the reaction to Sophia's predicament on Twitter. It's noted that the initial bug SR4 girls tweet associated with Sophia received over 175,000 impressions from other users, and that the Entomological Society of Canada's own Twitter account received direct messages from 135 unique users outlining their support. Of those 135 direct messages, 73% were from women. At Can Entomologist I've been that girl, became an entomologist still proudly wear bugs on my shoulder bug sr 4 girls pic twittercom de mop evate q8 Julia Karicheva at Karicheva Lab August 25, 2016 As far as Sophia's current state of mind, she seems dead set on becoming an entomologist and spending her life studying bugs. In the below GMA clip, she appears to be as big of a bug lover as ever, stating proudly that people think that bugs may be creepy and that bugs aren't cool, but bugs are cool. And so is Sophia's enthusiasm for entomology. What do you think about Sophia's story and the corresponding support from the entomological community? Let us know in the comments below. Need more bug stuff? Of course you do. Images flick of Patrice Puig. Bug SR4 girls. Bug girl. Bugs. Bully bug girl. Entomologist. Entomology. Insects. Little girl. Entomologist. Morgan Jackson. Nicole Spencer. Sophia Spencer. Sophia's story. Twitter.